good morning <coughs> um this is gonna be an <coughs> okay need some water this is gonna be an unusual video for me i know i look like a little bit of a mess but as you can tell from the title i got a really exciting package and I decided I'd kind of do like a vlog style unboxing um, only because I'm really excited for this collection and I think the piece is going to be really nice and even do a try on haul. It's This is what that is the definition of what this video is. So I am going to go get it but I was super excited because I ordered it like during early access and it took a solid week for them to send me the shipping confirmation which kind of sucked and the only reason why they had sent it to me was even because I had emailed them asking for my shipping confirmation so I know they're really busy handling all these shipments and I totally don't blame them I kind of wish there was a little bit more communication because I know in the past when companies have had like a large influx of orders they usually email everyone that's ordered something being like hey like there's a delay I'm sorry etc etc and they didn't do that which kind of sucked but I'm glad they were at least on top of it when I sent them an email so this is not going to be a video blaming either side I totally understand but just as a heads up if you decide to order any of these items there might be some sort of a delay so I'm going to go get it I am in sweatpants no bra and just my literally what I'm sleeping in so I'm going to go down to the mail room and pick up the package see you in a bit watching Estee's vlog about when she was in the package room for um, the ladies who were packaging up the jewelry to send. So I kind of know what it's going to look like but I'm interested to see inside anyway and um, it's actually cool that they put it in an, a, a FedEx envelope instead of like just putting packaging tape over it but it's a very plain box. I guess not super plain. They have like their chakra sticker on here. I don't even know if you can see that because I don't have any fancy camera equipment. I need scissors though. Which kind of sucks because the sticker is so pretty. Okay. Hopefully you can see that. So I, okay, I'm like a little bit excited right now. So I was watching um, the Daisy London's Instagram stories and they were saying that some of like the first couple hundred orders got like a hand signed card from Estee and <gasps> I did. I'm so excited. Honestly, she is one of those people that, like, one of those YouTubers I really want to meet. I've met Tati. I think if I could, I'd want to meet, um, Hey Claire from, or uh, Claire Marshall from Hey Claire. I'd want to meet Jen M, and I'd want to meet Estee. Like, I think I've been following Estee since before she hit, like, 500k. Um, and now she's at, like, I think almost 1.5 million, so I'm really proud of her. And obviously when she came out with this collection, I had to support her because she's amazing. Um, and I'm so happy. Oh my god. This is totally going on my wall because this is quite a moment for me. Um, anyways, so when you open the box, here's the Oh Hello box. Um, I'm going to link Estee's vlog below because I'm sure she's going to do a better job explaining how it's packaged. But then you open it, there is the chakra tissue paper that Daisy has, I guess. Um, the sticker, which I will try to keep. Um, might not be possible though because it's really sticky. Mm. Eh, we'll see. Okay. And then... 
I guess they give you like a bag. I guess it's only, for me, like, it, this makes zero sense. This is one of the things that I was very confused about when I was watching her video. Like, why they even include, like, an actual bag. It only makes sense if, like, I said I wanted it gift wrapped, but I didn't. So, I don't know. I guess it's, like, an extra perk, but I'm probably just going to end up, like, using it for, like, regifting or something. Anyway, so then they have it in one box. Um, I ordered three pieces. I think I ordered two pairs of earrings and one ring. Um, I'm not a big necklace person, but I really, really, really do want her snake chain. And ugh, I'm just like tempted to buy more because they're all so pretty and it's such a big collection. So here's the box it comes in. And then um, there are two bags right here. Oh, they're soft. Hopefully that will focus. This feels very luxurious and for the price it better be because these were pretty pricey. Um, it was actually interesting for me because I bought so I bought three pieces and I don't know why but as soon as I put three pieces in my cart it kind of discounted me. I don't know if they were doing some sort of promo back then um, for early access or for this particular collection but I was very happy because it just meant less money to be spent but I'm super happy with these pieces so let's see what's in the first bag. Ooh, the earring. Hopefully you can see that. So I've been really into like the hooped earrings that kind of come off. Like with like a, what's it called? A pendant, so to speak. So I got the bar ones because I think they're gorgeous. And I think they come separately. So here's the other one. I'm going to put these on in a second. But she was saying in her video that these are pretty these bags are pretty cute because they have like a divider which I don't think you'll be able to see that but there's like a divider in there so you can like put one jewelry on one side and the other jewelry on the other side this is cute oh my god okay then I bet this is the other pair of earrings plus the ring okay so I got these earrings oh they're smaller than I anticipated um, so yeah, I got the sunburst earrings right here, the uh, same one on the other side, there's no point showing you. And then at the back there's like a Daisy London engraving, which I bet you won't be able to see. But yes, it's there. Um, put it down, and then the ring right here. So you can tell that I got like all my, um, jewelry and sterling silver and that's only because I'm not a big fan of gold so let me just put these on I guess um, oh one other thing if you get their rings they're a little bit weird in size it's like small medium or large so you kind of have to guess but they do have a size chart for what ring size you are equals what's si what sizing they are so I think I chose a small because I'm a like six ring size so let's try it on it's a little bit big, actually. Wait, did I get a small? Oh yeah, so in the box it comes with Daisy Times or Estate, and I'm really excited to read this. But I'm pretty sure I got a small. I'm pretty sure I got a small. I have to check, but even a small is pretty big. So I think if you're a ring size like six or below, a small is still probably gonna be pretty big. Like I'll probably have to put it on this hand to make it like fit. But even then, that's like a little bit too loose. Um, but this is gorgeous, and it's so pretty. Look at that. Okay, you can't really see that here. I think the lighting is just bad. How's that? Okay, for the earrings, I am just going to put one on each ear and show you, like a close-up. Because um, it's harder to, for me to do that on a tripod. So let me just get the earrings out of their individual bags and then let me put them on. Hang on a second. That's fine. Super flattering angle of my double chin. Okay, so here is the sunburst one. Oh, they're so 
so cute and dainty. I feel like I have one. I've, I got my ears pierced when I turned 18 because it was one of those things my mom was just like, no, you can't do it. So then when I turned 18, I was like, I'm, I'm going to do it because now I'm 18. I can do anything I want. Um, oh, that's in there. And so it's been like five years since I got my ears pierced. In. Um, and I think five years later, I finally figured out how to put on earrings without looking in the mirror. Ooh, that's pretty. I can't tell because I'm just staring at my com the camera. But, um, yeah, let me put on the bar ones. My boyfriend just finished taking a shower. And I think it's about to come out. And it's going to see me vlogging. I think it's going to be weird for him. That's fine. No, no. You'll, you'll be in the vlog. I heard. Wait, are you doing stuff right now? Yeah. Oh. Why are you going to have... Your face isn't in it, I don't think, unless you come into my frame. Oh, so you're going to mute it, right? I don't know, will I? No. Should I open the window more so it has more? I opened it already. That's fine. Uh huh. Wait, I can't put this on. Oh, there it is. There we go. Worry about what? That my hole was closed? No, no. I'm gonna like pierce something. Pierce? I, I, it's impossible to pierce like a new hole just with earrings. No, no. Did I put it on right? Maybe I didn't. Even... No, I did. Cute. Toss oh, super here. Jeez. Okay. So, one on each ear. Oh, I don't know if the lighting is flattering or not. So, first impression. Um, I don't know if it's because of the material, but I will say that. I hate. I hate saying this. Um, the ring feels kind of cheap. Like, it feels like something I can buy for, like, $10 at, like, a child store. Like, Claire's. The earrings are really pretty. Um, I think it's just, like, the pendant feels really light. And it just feels like it's made of plastic. I don't know why. Um, if anyone can tell me, like, why it is. But I do really like the bar one a lot. So... If you're going to get any piece, I definitely recommend this earring, um, which I believe is actually sold out. So I'm sorry for recommending something that is sold out, but I'm pretty sure they're going to be bringing it back anyway. Um, I mean, I still really like the collection. I'm not going to return it because, well, support for Estee, but um, also because since discovering Daisy, there's just so many pieces that I want. Um, my basket currently has like 11 other items. I can even just show you. Hang on, let me just bring out my computer. Yeah, there's so many pieces I want. I think like the next thing I'm probably going to get from them is going to be the snake chain necklace that this day is always wearing. Oh my god, my laptop is so heavy. You guys, 15 inch laptops just aren't a good idea sometimes. <laughs> Crappy faces I'm making, I know. But yeah, I really want the snake chain necklace. And, um, from her collection and then they have like a daisy collection and they have like a pair of earrings that looks like this but it has a daisy on it i really really want that um but they are really pricey so i don't know if it's just because of like conversion rate or if like in the uk that's just standard but uh, let me show you what else i want from them because it's quite a lot and it's really rare for me to find a jewelry store especially online during store jewelry store that i really like so um even though like you know, the ring might feel a little bit, like, cheaper compared to, like, the price I paid for it. Um, I know that, like, when I, because I already spent a good amount of time on the website before this collection came out. So, comparing the prices, it's, um, her items is still, some, like, on the cheaper end. So, I think she's trying to make it a little bit more affordable, which I really do appreciate. Okay, let me just show you what other stuff I want from their collection. Um, yeah, so I really want these. I mean, 
flower or anything. Um, and then these are the daisy ones that I was talking about. I just think they're like beautiful. And then you can tell I really love earrings. Um, they have a chakra line and I think I want like two of, yeah, I want like this one and that one. Um, what's really cool about the website and by the way, this video is not sponsored. Um, I'm just really happy I discovered this jewelry line and I'm just sharing with you what I want and kind of doing a more vlog style than I usually do in terms of vlogs or videos anyway. So what's cool about their website is that, um, like as if you go here, like this is a chakra line, right? Um, and they actually at the bottom explain stuff. So like they tell you like this particular chakra is for, you know, balance and etc. like personal power, self-confidence, etc. So that is really cool. Um, and then let's see. So then this is the chain necklace and um, I did not realize I already own this now. So this is not going to be in there anymore. Let's just remove it. Yep, there we go. Um, and I now I really want these earrings. Um, I like dainty ones, and these are just right on my alley. I mean, like, seriously, that's gorgeous. Um, and then their Evil Eye Good Karma. Yeah. <sighs> Basically, I am just in an earring frenzy. Anyways, that is my review unboxing try on whichever um, i'm definitely keeping all the pieces like honestly i want to support estee and i really believe in her and i believe in you know her hustling and bustling to get um stuff done and i'm really proud of where she's gotten um yeah i'm really excited to potentially get other pieces I'm definitely going to be wearing at least the bar earring a ton and most likely this too because um, I really like the message of this as well. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed this video and I will link all the items in the description box down below. So if you are interested, you can definitely check it out. I do highly recommend it. Um, and if you have any questions, comments, concerns, or even other kinds of videos you want to see me do, like other potential brands that you would like me to purchase something from, um, let me know in the comments down below and I will see you next Sunday for another video. Bye!